What's going on guys and welcome back to the channel. So today guys I'm going to be showing you the best MP40 build here in Season 2 here in Vanguard. So if you guys are new to my channel, I upload the best class ups and the best gameplay. So if you guys could do me a huge favor, hit that subscribe button and as with that bell so you guys don't miss any more videos. It's absolutely free so if you guys could do that, make sure to do so. And if you want a shout out on my next video, make sure to say Noti Gang in the comment section. I'm going to be picking three people. Alright so for the first attachment for the MP40 guys, I'm adding on the recoil booster for that plus two fire rate. This can be really helpful. Helpful, help us be more aggressive we're gonna have a faster time to kill and looking at the papers here or the stat sheet we're gonna have a fire rate of 631.6 rounds per minute giving us a 5.3 percent increase for our weapon here it's gonna be really helpful so i'm adding this on for the first attachment all right, so for the second attachment, guys, I'm running the Crosslink 317mm 04B. This can help the MP40 be highly accurate and controllable, and plus it's going to dupe scope sway and gun bobbing. So having this on is really helpful. You're going to see a ton of kills coming from this. Easy V2 rockets, but looking at the detail sheet, we're going to have a plus 40% here in horizontal recoil control, and that 85% in here in eight idle sway control. So this is going to be really helpful for the MP40, and this is a really important attachment to run here on the MP40. All right, so for our third attachment, guys, we're adding on an optic, which is going to be the Crossnick ISO 1M. This can help with aim down sight speed, and it plus it's going to change how the iron sights look. So this is really helpful. We're aiming down sights quicker, helping us be more aggressive. And plus, when aiming down sights, it's going to be a lot clearer to see through. It's going to help you snap onto different targets. And plus, it's just way more easier to see through when aiming down sights. So I'm adding this on for the third attachment. All right, so for the stock guys, I'm adding on the 35M wire grip. This can help with aiming stability, recoil control, accuracy, and flinch resistance. So looking at the detail sheet here, our vertical recoil control is going up by plus 13.6%. Horizontal recoil control is going up by plus 13.8%. Our idle sway control is going up by plus 87.5%. And our flinch resistance is going up by plus 20%, making us really strong. Getting into those gunfights, you're not going to flinch at all making you win 99.9% .9 of those gunfights using this stock. So for perk 1, guys, I'm using Brace for that initial accuracy recoil control. This can be really helpful, so make sure to add this on. For our second perk, we're adding on Quick to increase our sprint speed, so this can be really helpful. We can be aggressive, flank easier, get away from people if we are hurt, and it's just going to be really helpful to get into those engagements quicker. So I'm adding on Quick and Brace from our two perks. For the rear grip, guys, we're adding on the fabric grip for that aim down sight speed, sprint to fire speed, and hip fire recovery. So having this on, looking at the detail sheets, our sprint to fire speed is going up by plus 4.4%, and our aim down sight speed is going up by 4.1%, so it's going to help us be really aggressive. We're going to have a really good run and gun type of MP40 build here, so I'm adding this on for the rear grip. For the magazine, I'm running the 9mm 64 round drum. This is just going to help with a larger magazine size. There's nothing really too crazy about the detail sheet here. Just knowing that we're having a larger magazine size, we're going to be able to carry more ammo, and it's going to be really helpful just to go on longer kill streaks, not really have to worry about ammo. So we're adding this on for the magazine. All right, so for the ammunition type, I'm running the length and rounds just for that bullet velocity of plus three. So looking at the detail sheet, it's going up by plus 30%, giving us a 458.9 meters per second, which is going to help the MP40 be way more aggressive. And it's going to kind of act like a little assault rifle. So we're adding this on for the ammunition type. And so for the final attachment, guys, I'm adding on the Mark VI Skeletal Grip for that aim down sight speed. So having this on is giving us another 4.1%. So we're aiming down sights really quickly, and this can help us get a lot more kills when getting into those close quarter gunfights. So this is a really good build to run. All right, so here is the full class if you want to take a screenshot of it. But anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. And kind of let me know in the comment section, what do y'all think about Season 2? Do y'all think it's an L? Do y'all think it's a W? I really can't wait for other stuff to come in season, which we have like, I don't know, maybe like 20-ish days until the midseason update somewhere around that time but anyways guys this is the mp40 build you guys need to use here in season two and let me show you what i got with this thing oh ah oh, man come on This map is going to be good for a ball turn, I believe. Oh, come on. Down. 
I didn't even see. Oh, okay. Bro, are we literally just like Fire? Was that fire? Uh, no, nah, it wasn't. No, bro. Fuck. I do not know where a soul is. It seems like they do like like the grenades and stuff, they like seem like they do the same amount of damage. Uh, okay, we're gonna use the ball turret now. I go crazy with it, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Oh my god. This is insane. I'm trying as fast as I can to get as many kills. All right, perfect. We just went from like 60, I, 
That was like 50 kills or something. Like, we went absolutely nuts. Yeah, we... Yeah, this thing is absolutely nuts. And we got burned. Go see you later. No, bro, what in the world? Hey, man. Hey, these rocks are like, I gotta mute y'all. These rocks are kind of annoying, like, trying to, like, just get through them and stuff like that. It's like, I don't know. Oh, that was close. Alright, we gotta call this in real quick, see how many kills we can get with it. We're gonna end the game in it. Oh, uh, come on. Let's go, 130 kills using this MP40 build. Oh my lord. 